Good morning. How are you? Time to wake up. 9.15, ready to go. I'm gonna have this yogurt drink. <laughs> I'm eating some bread and I stopped by the church because- that bone is gone. That human bone has disappeared. And that was wrapped up in a, like, like, in a, like in a bow with some green stuff. Oh, oh, spooky things. Road walk. Turning off the big road. My big excitement. Tractor rolling by. Woo! Small village. No bars, no shops. Church. Wow. Good way to rest the feet. Right beside the church is this very nice picnic area. And I have this sausage thing, dried sausage on a bun. Following this overgrown stream until I get to the next village. Running water and birds walking beside the stream. It's nice. Glad to be away from the fields. Actually, I'm not away from them. They're just behind me. <laughs> Over here is Gran Hall de Campos. It has a big church and it has a, a low-lying castle. Uh, it's a detour off the Camino to visit. It would add an extra two kilometers, which I would normally readily do. However, the castle's closed today. Well, it looks like all the arrows, well, most of the arrows over here are trying to direct people towards the village. But if the castle's closed, you just have to come back here the same way and go back out. I'm on a bridge. I'm on a bridge to win a bridge dance. Sign here with a lot of English, which is fantastic. I am so sorry, but close. <laughs> These dogs are too angry. My feet were sore, so I sat down. But now, one million sheep are coming, and those really, really angry dogs. So I'm gonna get out of here before they get close to They're me. They're just behind me, but I can't stay to look at the sheep. Those dogs are mean. Ugh. The end. Last city on the Camino Madrid. Whoa, here we are. 14 days later, entering the last town on the Camino Madrid, joining up with the Camino Francis. Church of the Pellegrina. It is really pretty. Look at this arch, wow. And then beside the monastery, trying to figure out how you get in for the albergue. Another monastery right beside it. This one's ruined. Here we go. Albergue of Santa Cruz. Five euros donativo. You have to go up to the other staircase. It costs five euros to stay in this monastery. You can pay a bit more and you can get a double room for 10 euros or a private room for 20 euros. But eh, this is very nice. Even though the, there's four beds in here, what makes it awesome is that, that's not the right light. There's a shower and toilet for the four beds, so that's great. I'm done the Camino Madrid. I'm done the Camino Madrid. Time for my shower. Lots of little rooms here in the monastery. I'm in room 19. This is the kitchen in the albergue. Mm -hmm. 
Coffee Machine if you would like to pay three euros. The registration area. When you come in, get offered a glass of water and a candy. Yeah, is my favorite grocery store because everything is cheap. Just got back from Camino, uh, Camino Coffee and Chat. Show you my groceries. Groceries. Pumpkin soup and Tinto Verano. I went back to the grocery store. I saw a friend. <laughs>